G'day. Thanks for watching RJF Channel 13 TV around Oz. I told you I'd show you my van. Don't expect too much. It's just a 83 Viscount, 16 footer. It's an old one, but she does what we want it to do. So yeah, here she is. Nice long drawbar for reversing. Homemade stone guard. Seems to do the job. A couple of nine kilo gas bottles. Get about three months each out of them. Cooking two meals a day, morning and night. And these see these regulators. The old barbecue ones are um, illegal now, so if you've got one of them, you might want to get one of these new ones. Save yourself getting a fine. You can get a single and double. I wanted a double, but when the gas man come and give me my certificate, he only had the single ones. So I got one of them. Odd T level. Not very accurate, but it does help. Yes. Anderson plug down here. It's for my um, portable solar panel. 80, 80 water. Got a bigger one on the roof. About 180 water. Might be a bit big, but better big than small. I'm running out of power. Yeah, so this is old van. Got the new wheels and tyres. The old Viscounts have HT stud pattern. But if you're not too sure, you're best off just taking the hub into a wreckers. They'll tell you straight away what it's off. Yeah, so. This is the old girl. Going to be home for a little while. Like I said, she's not all that, but it's got everything we need. We've got a port -a tent, all that. The only thing we haven't got at the moment is a shower, but we'll get one of them very soon. All right. Under here, I got my um, 120 amp battery going on off me. Solar panel on the roof. She's going over to here. That's um that's what it's hooked up to. It's my TV, it goes from 240 to 12. So when I want to run off the battery, I just have to unplug it, plug it straight into there. So switching leads. Digital readout and a couple of USB cords can go in there as well. Charge your iPhone, Android, iPad, whatever. Comes in handy. Yes. I've also got another battery underneath there. Goes to the Anderson plug outside for my portable solar panel. It's an 84 amp hour battery, that one. She all she does is runs the two lights inside and the one light outside. Got a digital readout down there for it, so I don't have to keep going in underneath there. A lot easier to Put a read out on the inside, on the outside. That hasn't gone flat on me yet either. A 240 12 volt TV. Picked them up pretty cheap from Harvey Norman, whatever. Vast box. I paid 80 bucks for that one. 20 bucks for me um, dish. I have seen them on eBay ranging anywhere between 250 and 450 dollars. So you don't need to spend the big money to have VAR, so you got TV wherever you go. Have been in places where there is no TV reception. So they come in real handy. Some bag thing my wife made. Put the shopping bags in. Just all tuck in and pull out. Save buying garbage bags. They just get put in there and put your rubbish in there top little stove and oven in these things switches off when the temperature's right and when it drops a bit comes back on automatically yes so that's my van said not too flash but everything we need over here I'll show you the dish I bought $20 um, nothing wrong with that come with the stand and everything all everything marked out on it all the angles degrees all that sort of stuff that's a hundred hundred bucks for the pair of them so you don't need to go and spend 300 400 a little 80 watt solar panel 
charges me battery for me lights. Yes. Yeah, so that's me van. So, yeah. If you like my videos and want to keep watching, subscribe, share, tell your friends about it. And yeah, I hope you enjoy our little um, trip around this beautiful country of ours. And um, take it easy. Have a good day. And be kind to your mother. Thank you.